Hi, it's Teresa here. Now, I'd like to introduce you to our 10-way maxi scarf. Now, this is just a new product that we're launching, and this particular print is the PowerShell print. Let me tell you a little bit of a backstory about the PowerShell print. So, I grew up in New Zealand, and PowerShell is the native shell of New Zealand. And my father, uh, I would accompany him uh, to, to the beach to collect power shells. And he was very talented and crafty. And what he did, was he would um, polish the power shells and make stuff from them. I'll show you a few of these things. So the print that I've got now in the scarves is actually from this set of bookcases. Well, book, bookcases. No, they're not bookcases. They're book ends. Right, so you put your books there. Um, and they are um, iridescent. So that means when, when you move them around in the light, different colors show up. So I photographed them and I, I took hundreds of photos of all the different angles. And I um, put them all together by computer um, into a print. Now my father also used to make the most exquisite jewelry now I've got one of the necklaces on that he made this is a brooch it's absolutely divine another brooch here little fish and um, oh another gorgeous necklace here and some of these things are just so so tiny where is it oh a little a little leaf native to New Zealand and where's that there's a there was a little baby fish here it is not sorry fantail bird native bird to New Zealand and look how gorgeous it is it's absolutely tiny and my father had the biggest hands and I just marvel at how he um, did all these details anyway so that's the backstory of this amazing print so it's like I'm carrying on his legacy here. So let me show you a few ways to wear this maxi scarf. So like I said in the title, really you can wear it 10 ways. So here it is, it's lovely and long. I'll show you how to wear it as a strapless dress. So you just go around like that, hold it far enough away to tie a little knot, tuck the knot inside, and you've got this gorgeous tropical dress. Here is how to use it as a halter dress. So even it up and twist one around the other. All right, one twist. And that gives you a lovely drapey look across the front and tie it into a double knot at the back. There we go, halter dress. Now I'll show you how to wear it as a lovely long boho vest. Oops, dropped it. Folding it in half. All right, and taking these two ends and tying them together into a double knot. Just a neat little knot. Open it up, and we have a vest. Pull it so the knot sits mid back. Now, as with the Paris vest, you can just grab the ends and tie a tiny knot, and that secures it. Um, but this morning I was having a play, and you can actually make it into a wrap dress. So here's how you do that. I just take one end, and bring it to the side. I'll take some fabric from the side and tie them together into a little knot. There you go. And voila, we have a lovely wrap dress that's not going to blow open. And if you want arm coverage, you just flick the fabric out on the side. So this is perfect for high tea, lunch, Great if you're on a cruise. Now I'll show you how to wear it as a sarong. 
So you had your lunch and you're in the pool and you want a bit of coverage when you come out of the pool. So the length, because it's lovely and long, it's actually too long to make into a sarong. So what we do is we just fold it, fold it inwards until you're happy with the length. So we'll do quite a bit of a long one. So I'm just folding it, well, maybe a quarter of it inwards. Put it around your waist. Grab the fabric far enough away from your waist to tie a little knot. Position it high or low on your waist. If you don't want to show too much of your tummy, just tighten it higher up. And there we go. We've got a lovely little um, flowy sarong. And if you want a mini sarong, you just fold the whole thing in half. You can loosen it and put it over your bust. Now, some of us love to wear turbans. I'm going to do a turban. Fold it in half, right? Put it over your head. Now, do it in front of a mirror. Take these ends and fold one across the other like this, all right? Bring it to the front. Don't worry how you look at the front at this stage. Do a twist, one twist. And bring it to the back. And I know I look a bit weird, but don't worry. Tie a little knot, double knot. I'll just do single for now. Then you fix it up. I've actually got a mirror behind the camera. So I'm looking in the mirror. I'm tucking it in. I don't have a comb with me, but if I had one, I would fix my hair up. Okay, so there we go. We got a lovely turban out of that huge fabric. It just um, condenses really nicely. Okay, so uh, this is perfect to take on holidays simply for the reason that you can get so many looks out of it. Now, even in winter, this is a great uh, item to wear to bring some color. So wear it as a scarf, but in summer, you can uh, use it to keep the sun off your shoulders. So uh, there we go. And uh, if, when you're out in the evening, you can have it as a shawl. There you go. And it's lovely and bright and colorful. Right, I hope you've enjoyed uh, watching this. So keep an eye out for more designs. There's, there's a few more coming. And that's the 10-way maxi scarf.